On May 30th, over 100 citizens of Rockford, Illinois had their human rights violated by the Rockford Police Department. In the two months that have followed, not a single sliver of justice has been delivered to those victims. Since the city is oblivious to what justice looks like, here is seven point stands to begin remedying the evils done by the Rockford Police Department on May 30th outside Precinct 1. Number one, we demand all charges in connection to the protest on May 30th be dropped immediately without contingency on any agreement or deal being signed by the wrongfully accused parties. Two, we demand the city of Rockford procures an entity outside of the Rockford Police Department to investigate the actions taken by officers on May 30th due to the conflict of interest. Three, we demand the inherent biased findings of the Rockford Police Department investigation and the findings of the investigation done by an outside source be released in full without redactions to the public. Number four, we demand to be informed of the badge number and name of each officer at Precinct 1 on May 30th, informed of each officer who made an arrest, and to be informed of each officer who discharged their taser. Number five, we demand all elected officials in the city of Rockford condemn the actions taken by the Rockford Police Department on May 30th and also condemns the lack of results the investigation into the conduct of Rockford Police Department on May 30th has yielded. We demand the city of Rockford make accommodations and pay in full for the services of counselors, therapists, or psychiatrists, or anything else needed to help the mental health of those traumatized by the actions of their officers. The city should make accommodations for up to 12 months to pay these services for each individual. And finally, number seven, we demand that all officers that participated in the violation of the human rights of the protesters on May 30th be terminated immediately and their crimes against humanity be punished to the fullest extent of the law.